Hey guys, it's Chief from Skull Gaming Network. Welcome to another MLB Perfect Inning 2018 video, and welcome to today's maintenance and new event guide. We'll start here with the maintenance. During maintenance, the game cannot be used. It starts at 11 a.m. Korean time with the time change that is now 9 p.m. Eastern, and it lasts for five hours, so until 2 a.m. Eastern. Once again, the game cannot be played during maintenance. What are we getting? 2018 award winners players are being added. They're adding all-star special emblem players for home run derby winners, all-star MVPs, and all-star vote leaders, it looks like. They are ending the Thanksgiving event, but you will have one more week to trade in Thanksgiving items before they are removed from your inventory completely. Live draft free draw function will be resuming as normal. And then they are adding the December special events and ending the existing event. And if we look at some of the award winners, they have Gold Gloves Rookie of the Year. They have a Hank Aaron Award winner card for J.D. Martinez. They've got MVPs for Mookie Betts Regular Season, Jackie Bradley Jr., the ALCS, Steve Pierce, the World Series, Cody Ballinger, the NLCS, and Christian Yelich, the NL MVP, along with Hank Aaron Award in the NL and a gold glove in the NL. And then for pitchers, just saves, leaders, and Cy Young Award winners. 93 DeGrom, 92 Snell, both nice. And then if we look at the All-Star Special Emblem cards, some of these cards are good. In the low 90s. Other ones, Chris Davis, 2013 vote leader, only a 75. Are you kidding me? Cespedes won the 2014 home run derby, a 79. Frazier wins the 2015 home run derby and gets an 86. Okay, Gameville. But a Mike Trout with 102 base power, a Stanton with 103 base power. An Aaron Judge with 102 base power. 101 power on a Josh Donaldson as well. And 101 power on a Bryce Harper. There are some nice cards. It's just weird to see those ones in the 70s. Then for pitchers, they gave starting pitcher cards to the pitchers that started each All-Star game. Now, all of these are at least pretty much reasonable. Lowest is an 84 Chris Sale, highest is a 92 Max Scherzer. Everything else falls somewhere within that range. As for the December special event, we start off with our daily login rewards. Get 100 of something on Thursday, it looks like Diamonds. Three, I believe, B-grade trainers Friday. Looks like 100 million GP Saturday. 50 of something on Sunday, might be complete tickets. 200 million GP on Monday, 1,000 of what I'm going to guess is training points on Tuesday, and what looks like an A-grade trainer on Wednesday. Log in all seven days, you get a 90-plus overall draft. Number two, perfect training odds are doubled for the next week. Number three, the number of cards that you can use for boosting goes from 10 to 15. Number four, the cost to boost a player is just counted by 30 percent so a car that would cost a billion coins to boost will only cost 700 million coins to boost number five depending how much money you spend on this game you'll get various gp rewards but none of those black friday or cyber monday deals will count it's only from november 29th through december 6th so this next week after the new maintenance is done and before the next one and then event six, Jigsaw Puzzle Stadium Fit number eight will be released. I'll put number seven up on the community tab for anyone interested who hasn't figured it out yet. But with that being said, that's going to do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like. If you're new around here, subscribe for more MLB Perfect Inning 2018 content. In the comments, if you have any questions, feel free to ask them. And either myself or someone else in the community will try to answer those questions the best we can but that being said that's going to do it for this video guys i'm g from skull gaming network thank you so much for watching and until next time and as always
Peace out.